And now, what do you expect from Spurs in this game on Wednesday? Um, I don't have any expectations. I just see it as a, uh, another game, another big game, and uh, just to go out there and uh, do my best. Have you got a plan for Harry Kane? Not really, no. <laughs> Not yet, at least. Well, you mentioned the penalty at the World Cup. Any kind of psychological edge might help, I guess. Ah, no, 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 I won't. <laughs> when you are playing a top team like this, though, a team that is going for the Champions League in the Premier League, how different is it to sort of the run-of-the-mill league match? Um, of course, the the mistakes you make um, will be even more punishable because of the quality of players they have. And uh, I'd say the biggest difference is that you have to stay stay concentrated like all of the time because if you switch off for one second, they just turn, run and shoot, score because the quality is there. How big is it that this game is at Bramall Lane and could that give you a bit of an edge because Tottenham have played at that stadium a number of times over the years, they've never found it easy. Yeah, of course, the atmosphere is a, is a big thing. Um, the atmosphere we had now against Watford it was it was really good and uh, it puts a lot of pressure on the on the teams that come here and uh, it makes it makes the game uh, much better for us. Yeah. Obviously, the main aim is to be a Premier League team yourselves next year and win promotion. But how important do the players feel like winning a game like this is to continue in the FA Cup? to try and get to the next round? I mean, if you, if, if you win this game, uh, we, will get, we will get a lot of confidence, of course. But uh, as I see it, it's, it's another game. It's another uh, chance to, to win a game. Um, I love winning games. And uh, if I don't win a game, I've, I feel depressed until the next game comes. And uh, um, yeah, I mean, it's a, it's a really big game now, so um, it will be a good 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 chance to to see where we stand um, if we do get the promotion. Uh, but that is f uh, far away now. We have a lot of games left still to play. You seem to be really enjoying life at Sheffield United. Why has it worked so well for you this year? Um, I don't know. I'm I like the culture here, uh, England. England is perfect for a uh, perfect fit for my playstyle. Um, uh, obviously, I, I planned it before joining uh, Sheffield United. Uh, I spoke with the coach. Um, I, m I made sure that this step was the right one. And uh, of course, I could have taken uh, probably went, go, gone on to a bigger league than the championship. But I think this this step was was perfect for me. You seem to have a lot of fun. I don't think you can say that about all of the players who, who play the game. Why, why is it so fun for you? And has it always been that way? Because I've always wanted to join in on attacks, but I've been a defender, <laughs> centre-back. So now that uh, the gaffer allows me to join in, I'm enjoying it. And just being, I don't know, and just playing football at this level and uh, having, having, having Football as my life is, is just, I don't know, it's just, I just love it. And I'm, I'm that type of guy, I could joke about everything. And in the middle of, ga of a game, I could just, I don't know, just <laughs> joke a little bit. I'm just that type of guy. Do you reckon you could play up front? Do you reckon you could get a yeah, few of if course, you played up there? Yeah, of course. Of <laughs> course. I think so. I think if, uh, if the coach wanted me to play up front, I could, have, I could do a good job. And what do you make of Sheffield? You know, how, how do you, you, you said you, the culture of, of England and English football kind of suits you, but how does Sheffield suit you and how does it compare to Bordeaux? Uh, it's a big difference. Yeah, in Bordeaux it was a lot warmer and uh, a lot more sun. <laughs> But I would say the nature here is amazing. Um, it reminds me a lot of uh, uh, Bosnia uh, and uh, the mountains and stuff like that. So coming to Sheffield, it was perfect fit because mm. it reminds me of my uh, home. And just finally, back on the game, the club is having a fantastic season. Obviously, could get even better. You know, if you're not that far away from Wembley now in the FA Cup. If you're able to achieve something like that. How special could this season become? Of course, it could be, become a great season, but 
if we if we look too much forward, then it can all be taken away like this. And uh, I think the 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 most most important thing we can do is just focus on the game that's coming. Uh, if we keep focusing on Wembley, if we keep fo focusing on uh, the next five games, it will just it will not be good. If we just focus on the next game and take it game by game, at the end of the season we can look back and think, yeah, we achieved everything.